Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've been all waiting for is here. Adidas has been cancelled by the people, and now they are pleading for Kanye West to come back. Karma is real. Adidas ruthlessly dropped Kanye West because they thought they would benefit more when he was out of the picture. This is the man who pushed Adidas from $15 billion to $60 billion in worth. The difference is enormous, yet they thought they were now so big that losing their pioneer wouldn't hurt them, this just shows how selfish and dumb they are. Kanye West was like the driver for Adidas, this man made Adidas relevant. People actually paid attention to Adidas because of Kanye West and his Yeezys. Meaningful people would have ended their partnership with the legendary rapper in a good way and given him what belongs to him, but that's not Adidas' way, they went full force trying to completely bury Kanye West without realizing he was a seed, and the boy turned into a tree in no time. Kanye West is the only person in this life who has the most loyal fanbase, these people promised him that they will sink Adidas and its plans. Guess what? It's happening now. The company warned that it's expected to lose $1.3 billion in revenue this year because it's unable to sell the designer's Yeezy clothing and shoes. Adidas ended its partnership with Kanye because of greed, and they are paying a heavy price for that awful decision. Adidas set its financial guidance for 2023 accounts for the significant adverse impact of not selling the existing stock. If the company can't repurpose any of the remaining Yee clothing, Adidas said that could cost the company $534 million in operating profit this year. Shortly after the partnership with Kanye was dissolved, the company said that it would try to sell the clothing stripped of the Yeezy name and branding, hoping to save the company about $300 million in royalty payments and marketing fees. Despite that attempt, Adidas is going down all because of the fans who vowed not to buy anything from them again. Kanye West is still winning.